Hello everyone and welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. Today we're doing a Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine counterpart reading. Um, it's a collective reading for you guys that don't know what a collective reading is. It's no signs. It's just Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Um, I'll point any signs that stand out to me. Yeah, but it's for the collective. It's for whoever it may resonate for. And it's in regards to Lion Gate season, okay? Okay, so under the deck we have bring love into the situation, new moon in Aquarius. Okay, so that was the bottom of the deck. That's going to be the overall energy for the reading. It The full moon in Aquarius just passed, so pretty sure that's the Aquarius energy we're feeling right now. Under the deck on this side we have the Emperor, Eris. Aries Taurus energy with bring love into the situation and Emperor here together I want to say somebody is depriving their feelings they're either trying to hide him trying to um, deny they exist or just is bottled up altogether so we're gonna go ahead and dive in divine feminine a new start is coming the new moon and it's time to take action. Capricorn. Oh, I'm sorry, Aries. Okay. The moon is always Pisces and Cancer. And then for Divine Masculine, we have the energy is gaining momentum. And what do you need to release? This is like, um, hmm. so there's definitely a coming together because both of your energies have it, but both of you guys have blockages. You guys are both being blocked, bringing love into the situation by two different things. Divine Masculine over here has to release something we'll figure out what exactly and over here in divine feminine it's time to take action so with this i want to say uh maybe trying to step out of your comfort zone okay so for the challenge we have justice libra energy and the full Aries aquarius Aries and Aquarius. Sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. I can't say Aries today. Okay. There is a separation here. Um, maybe due to arguments. Maybe due to disagreements. Um, maybe due to somebody not showing enough love to the situation. But um, with the Justice card here, I want to say that Source is coming in to fix that. 
if they haven't already put their foot down to kind of, you know, cut this sword, cut and release whatever it is out of this person's life and cut the fear out of this person's life to really get into this full energy, going ahead and taking the leap of faith. Why is a new start and it's time to take action for Divine Feminine? Okay. okay, we have let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. Trust the situation is calling for you to have faith. Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, Twin Flames, Unions, um, always divinely guided, obviously. So let's just get a couple more on this. Very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Okay. That's more like it. So we're, mo we're both manifesting. That's what's going on. Yeah, we're both attraction. So you guys are both using the law of attraction on each other. And... It's not working out for either of you because there's control issues and trust issues. And that's where this justice is meant to be served because you guys have to clearly state and clearly open up to what it is you guys really want. Whether it be this person, whether it be something else, whether it be a job, a career, it could be anything. Hold on, let's see. there could be potentially another blockage here it's time to give rather than take yeah okay someone has definitely not been playing fair to say the very least communication is key okay and this all makes sense control issues over here gets mad with trust issues over here doesn't have patience um, to communicate that they're trying to attract them towards them because they're too busy with their career and it caused a separation and that's where this justice card comes in and then we have this could be the one and honeymoon yeah Okay. Very soon, you guys. Communication is t communication is key, and whoever's been giving to the relationship more needs to take a step back and let the person who has been making I don't know, let's say, making more time for their career and finances that kind of caused this little you know tussle and separation here. Just give them a little bit of space. Universe, any advice for this spread for the Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, Lion's Gate season? My vibes speak louder than my words. Law of attraction, guys. Someone needs to use it right, though. Or both of you guys need to correct your um, manifestation skills. Because there's some um, bitterness in this. It's, uh, it's almost like a salty taste in my mouth. I always trust the direction of the universe and know I'm being guided. Yeah, I want to say that's for control issues over here. Alrighty. One more, one more spirit. Okay. The universe has your back. All right, y'all. Divine feminine, divine masculine looks like the union could be around the corner as long as you guys know that communication is key as long as we let go of control issues let go of trust issues use the law of attraction correctly and hopefully this separation gives you some kind of time to love yourself and then you could give your relationship a chance there you are okay guys i hope this helped
and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.